House Mouse by Michael Hall. One chilly morning, a mouse traveled over a hill, across a river, and into a wild asparagus patch. <laughs> I didn't know asparagus was grew in a patch. <laughs> um, where she found something remarkable. The mouse made of stove. Oh no, I missed, I'm sorry. Um, it was warm and welcoming. The mouse made a stove. To make the spot where the children's chillness wasn't. One day, a hungry fox chased the mouse past the forest and in and out of a valley. And all of a sudden, the fox stopped in his tracks. The mouse made a floor. to mark the spot where the fox couldn't go. Wouldn't go, I'm sorry, wouldn't go. But when she hopped onto her floor, it was peaceful and dry. to mark the spot where the rain didn't fall. For many days, the mouse lived happily on a steady diet of asparagus soup. <laughs> One night, the mouse heard a sound, knock, 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 but nothing was there. She heard it again the next day. Knock, knock, knock. Still, nothing was there. So the mouse made a door to mark the spot, to mark the spot. Bang, bang, tap, bump where the knocking had been. And when she opened it, please come in, she said to the two tired travelers huddled outside. That evening, the new friends made a delicious vegetable soup. At its, at, mm, oh, at its best, it was a welcoming place. And the house mouse wanted everyone to know it. And she still does. <laughs> and a story. <laughs> House mouse. <laughs> uh.